Let's get the latest on what's happening there with our correspondent Javed Rana in Islamabad. Javed? As we speak, uh, there's a pitch battle being fought outside Islamabad. The police has been preventing thousands of protesters from entering inside the capital city, Islamabad. Now, uh, situation remains unclear about the exact number of the people who are trying to storm into the capital, but certainly that runs into thousands. Uh, coming along with them is the chief minister of Northwestern province, uh, who belongs to the opposition parties. Now, at the heart of the entire political crisis that is unfolding in Pakistan is Panama Papers, according to which Prime Minister's family set up offshore business outside Pakistan, and opposition is blaming that Prime Minister channeled money illegally to set up the offshore business of his family. Uh, opposition has been demanding that the Prime Minister must set up an independent, a genuinely independent judicial commission. Prime Minister is not willing to do that, and Prime Minister is coming up with, with his own terms and conditions. That is not acceptable, and that is the reason that no opposition wants the resignation of the Prime Minister. But the bigger problem in Pakistan is in what manner the powerful military is going to react, because the military has been having a bad relation with the civilian government on a different issue. For the government, military believes that the government is having a soft approach towards India, and that is why it is not very happy. And there was a, a, a leak in the media which government, uh, uh, which military believes that the civilian government has leaked information uh, which goes against Pakistan's security interests. So I think it is going to be the military uh, which in coming days and weeks they are going to decide the very fate of Prime Minister Nawaz Sharif. Thanks, Javed. Javed Rana there in Islamabad.